Hi, how are you doing? Janine here from Janine Jackson Hairdressing. So um, earlier today I posted um, a picture of a really supernatural looking um, balayage. So I thought that I'd just do a quick little video and, and let you know how I did it for um, you know those hairdressers out there or maybe clients that like to be informed and want to ask hairdressers about it. Um, all I did was take the section across the back of the head from ear to ear. And really, really, really simple. I just took my sections on the diagonal like that. Um, and when I painted um, the colour on, um, the bottom of the foil I had down to the roots. And then the top of the foil I had drifting down off the roots and then blended it together and then folded it up. The reason I like to use foils um, for balayage, um, particularly that one that I posted today, was because my client had a reasonable amount of colour build up in their hair. So by using the foil, it helps the colour to process more and it will lift further. Another little trick I use is that when I'm mixing my lightener, and I know you guys like it really sort of silky smooth and like custard, but in order to get it to move a little bit further, I put a little bit more powder in and a little bit less developer, and we get a bit more movement um, in the colour, particularly when you've got build up. Then when it um, came to the side section, same thing, I just sectioned through the temple and I just stuck with that um, angle for the, um, the balayage there. So um, just showing you on this side here. So take your section like this. And um, you know, we, you can use slices for this technique too because you can't see where it begins and ends. And then when it was like this, this side here right down to the roots, this side here high, blending it into the middle like that. Um, and to tone, um, I like dry toning because it can cover the hair more, particularly if it's not going to be perfect, you know, that first couple of times that you're trying to go back from dark to light. Um, so dry tone, put the toner on, left it on for 15 minutes and then shampoo it off. Um, you know, when you get your top section like this, We've got the part there, I never leave, I never take it all the way through there. I just take a thin section out there like that and I call that a veil and that falls over the top and do the same thing all the way around the head. So it's really quick um, and it's super natural looking. So um, if you guys do have any questions about what I do and how I do it, then um, just flick me a message. Um, otherwise, I'll see you guys next week.